Welcome back to the channel with Paradox the Rapper. Today we're at the Sacramento International Airport and we're gonna go buy our first supercar. How excited are you? I am Let's so go. excited. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we just showed up at the airport. This is wild. We're flying to LA right now. We're gonna be picking up our supercar. Stay tuned. I'm gonna show you which one we're getting. All right, she's getting the tickets right now. This is the Sacramento International Airport. If you guys haven't been here yet, they just redid this whole thing. So it looks beautiful. It's like a giant airplane hangar. So normally Michelle wouldn't let me get another car because we already got too many. But uh, the accountant says we should get this one. <laughs> and it's going to be mine. What? It's going to be mine. Why is it yours? Because it's mine. You don't even like cars. Uh, I love this car. <laughs> so she wants something and that she... The Audi, you've been promising me the Audi was going to get fixed. Audi's not getting fixed. Oh, so yeah, here I've we got go. dibs. She, I've got dibs. I'm she, just saying. <laughs> she basically likes a car you can just jump in and drive. And uh, it's not like really modified yet, but we'll fix that. Don't worry, we're going to slam this one too. Yes. Always a special day when I got shoes on for once. Getting on planes always makes me nervous. I can't, I can't believe this is happening. Like, <laughs> I can't ever imagine like three years ago when I first started doing this, that we would be flying to LA to pick up a supercar. This is just, this is just so awesome. Like, I can't believe it. And all thanks to you guys for watching the channel and for using my guides on how to do your own cars and man the grind has been serious i'm literally in the garage every day like monday through sunday just grinding it out doing cars whether it's a customer's car or if it's mine and then just stacking up that bread bro like literally you just have to put your nose to the grindstone and then just envision what you want to do like for five years and then just start doing it if you do it a little bit at a time incrementally you can be doing this like going to pick up a whole ass car and then driving it back home this thing's gonna be a great addition to the channel like uh you know i've always had like just busted up cars as you can see in my collection um and this is really the first one that's gonna have like three miles on it brand new 2022 so i can't believe it this is awesome. Oh, we made it. <laughs> I'm so glad we're driving back and not flying back. All right, guys, here it is. Oh, no, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. <laughs> it's not the Supra. <laughs> no, 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 no. That was a consideration, but I really don't like the way they look in the back end. Okay, you have to really like wide body that thing, get the wing, get the whole shebang done for it to look good in my opinion. I don't like the stock body Supra. It's something else. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> Not yet on the Tesla. We're waiting for the Roadster, okay? That eight second Roadster. All right, we're finally here. What up to the people from the LBC? We're at Harbor Chevrolet in Long Beach, California, and we're picking up the car. Of course, since we're at Chevrolet, you know what time it is. Shout out to them. Let's go find this thing. Oh my goodness, look at this red one. Oh my God, oh, it is. Okay, this is a red coupe. Oh no, it's a red convertible. Ooh. With the red interior. Oh, snap. Snappy. Snappy. Okay. Sick. Look at all these guys. Yo, my man, George. What's good, brother? Hey, nice hey. seeing you, man. Shout out to George hey. right here. What's going on, guys? This guy is the man. When we were looking for this car, I called like eight different dealerships. Okay. And George is the only one that made me feel like he want the deal to happen. All right. cool. Everyone was like, cool. mm, we got a couple of them <laughs> in maybe, you know, uh, I don't know. We'll take a look at it and call you back. But George was like, oh, I got you right now. Okay, <laughs> you saw it on the Chevy website. Okay, it's in transit. Let me see if it's coming. Right. Then he hit me back real quick and he was like, okay, it's coming in. These are the features. We can do it for you for this much. Or what are you looking at financing? Like he, he worked out the whole deal because I was like, all right, this is a situation. This is what we got to work with. 
Cool. Can you make this happen? I put them on blast. I was shocked <laughs> that your guys, yeah, or I'm sorry, your guys, the other dealership yeah. wouldn't make it happen, and they looked at your credit. I was like, what? When we started credit, I was like, yo, done, yo, done. they didn't even call me back. I had it. I, I like submitted my credit the first time. So what Chevrolet? Somebody. Which one? Well, it wasn't even a Chevy dealership. It was like oh. some place that hoards all the all the exotics. Mm. Mm. Yeah. And they happen okay. to have a, a, a Corvette. They couldn't get it done. So. No. Yeah, no. They, I was like, that. they were like, mm, Harbor okay. Chevrolet. <laughs> <laughs> Right, yes, and then sir. I had to call them back, and I was like, "What's happening?" They're like, uh, "We can't do it. But you, you didn't have the, you know, the time yeah, to call me." Not. But George, he worked the whole deal out in one day, guys. He made it happen. So if you're looking for a vet, this is the man to go get yep. it. Oh, you, no. oh, okay, there you go, there you George. Go. Start on him, George. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not too bad. How many? How many of you guys got available here? Um, right now, <laughs> you can all, all these. We got all these available. Oh snap! None yeah. of these are called for. When you came in, uh, or your your uh, your call came in, we kind of pre-sold you that one. Uh -huh. All of a sudden, we started getting more. We're like, what? We're accumulating some vets, getting on the phone. These just came in recently, and then I probably have a couple more in the back. I do have a C A R that just came in. C A R. What's the difference? You haven't you haven't seen that? No, let's no. go check them out. Oh, let's check it out. Yeah, okay, we'll okay. Out. We didn't get the C A R, but. <laughs> it's, it's, well, it's a little different. Maybe, it's just like a little special edition. Maybe is it more horsepower? No. No. You'll see what I mean. Oh, when you okay. see it, then you'll be like, oh, this is what it is. Uh, it's a certain it's, edition. Yeah, if it's not more right, horsepower and it's not it's not more wide body, it's not worth it. We're waiting for that Z06, baby. Okay. Or that Z01. Okay. Hey, can you get me uh can you get me the line on reserving a Z06? Oh man, <laughs> I know. There's, 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 there, it was like uh, two years ago, people started trying to be in line already. <laughs> it's crazy. And um, we'll see. What we'll we see. Don't do here, we don't. We can't. Uh, you know, slide in line. Okay. Okay. Oh, when when it comes out, I'm just gonna hit you up anyways. Maybe you you know somebody. Say no one. <laughs> Maybe we'll make it happen somehow. <laughs> Get in line, guys. Get in line. Oh, oh, there it is. Is that is that us? Oh. Honey, oh, no, that's me. That's mine. <laughs> she already knows. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is it good? Is it's, it good? It's amazing. It's better than expected. Oh. Have you already? Have you guys already drove the? the <laughs> we've we've never we've never driven a C8 before. That's your complimentary. So <laughs> we're we're buying it sight unseen. <laughs> okay. Okay. You guys ready to see this? Ooh, you guys ready to see this? It looks so good. <laughs> oh I can't believe it. Oh, there she is. But remember this: when you put the top down, and it is without the Look at that thing, dude. This is so badass. Dang. Yo, yo, my first new car, guys. Guys, I've never bought a new car before. I've always bought the beaters. Like literally, uh, <laughs> literally, like I've only ever bought cars that are like four or five thousand dollars or less with hella miles on it. Hella miles on it. As you can see, my fleet. And I usually don't like to do car payments, but <sighs> bro, this one? Oh my god. <laughs> yes, yes, I do consider this an American supercar. Okay. Shout out to Amelia Hartford. She said it first. So, there you go. Our first supercar. Ooh, baby. Dang, dang. You can see the, the little engine in there. Not the little, the big engine in there. V8 mid-engine? What's up, bro? Okay, let's see if we can pull this out. All right. Nothing like this. Super Here we light. go. Here we go. This is the C-A-R. Ooh, hey, that color is kind of fire. Right? This is cool. It's like a green. Look at the interior. Oh, they glow. Oh, not okay. But it's light gray. Light gray on the inside. This is like a yellow. Like it's got the little yellow. This. This gray is kind of like a millennium jade almost. If it looks like it's. Little extra decal. That's all it is. It looks like it's a little green. That's cool. This one is not a convertible. You can sell. You know. Oh yeah. There you go. On the non-convertibles, you can see the whole engine. So what what makes this one special? The package, man. This is a what's like different? I said the decals. It's got the the, the yellow painted stripe. 
Okay. Or, um, it's got the yellow, well, I'm sorry, I shouldn't say painted. Yeah, that is that is a stripes. vinyl stripe. Uh -huh. It also has the um, the painted yellow um, brake calipers as well as the interior. It only comes this way. It's like a sky cool gray, they call it. Okay. Sky cool gray interior is called strike. Okay. So as you can see, the, the yellow stitching, yellow seat belt, um, but it's part of a package here, here, check it out. It's part of this package right here, watch. Ah. This package right here, the C8R oh, edition. Oh, I see, I see. Look at that, 72,000. <laughs> hey, all the vets are going for like 100K plus right now. Right, they are. Do you think it will stay that way when the Z06 comes out? Uh, I don't think they're gonna devalue like that. I don't think they're gonna tank. They're still gonna be out there and they're still gonna be, uh, you know, sought after and people are still gonna want them, but that, that. But I don't think you can ever get them. any Corvette these days. Like no C8 will ever go for like under 80, right? They're always, re Not I'll new. tell you this, listen to this. This is gonna sound like a crazy story. All right, all right. But about a, less than a month ago, we received a 2019 um, Chevy, Corvette Grand Sport. Nothing special about the engine. Same engine as a regular Stingray, yeah. but the body kit is a little different. I don't know if you've seen them before. Oh, as a matter of fact, yeah, I just wrapped one. Yesterday. Yes. <laughs> I already saw the video. Okay, the, C, the, the okay, C7, wait, right? Right. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so that guy comes in and sells us his car. We have to pay a pretty good amount of money, but we put it on sale for like, um, I don't know, 75 or 78, 995. And it sold for like 82. Ooh. Wow. And that was two years ago, 15,000 miles. It's crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah man. When people used to say, oh, no, prices don't go up for cars. You know, they just devalue. And it is true for the most part. But some of them right now, have huh? held up their value Depends pretty well. Depends on the car. My buddy's you like. All see, you don't see. There's a, there's not a ton of Stingrays and, you know, Corvettes yeah. out. You know, when you see one, you're like, oh, look at that Corvette. Yeah. Right. Look at that Corvette. Yeah. Right, right. Because there's a ton of them. Out there. Well, my buddy's like, wait for the Z06. Don't pay for the C8 right now. But the thing is, everyone's waiting for the Z06. I gotta get while. in line for like two yeah. years. I don't, it's like it's like if you're Will Smith and you're coming into the party and they're like, Nah, Will, you're gonna have to wait. <laughs> like what? Yeah. I'm Will Smith. <laughs> uh, yeah, you no, gotta no, wait. you gotta wait. <laughs> you gotta wait. <laughs> right. And bang for your buck. If you're looking for something in this horsepower that looks like this. C8 really can't beat, there's nothing else that can beat the C8, okay? You're looking at a Supra, which you gotta do a whole bunch of mods to, or you're looking at an R8, which is 50K, 100K more than this. So this is so nice for the price that it is. All right, man, thank you. Let's hey. let's go get our car. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. We're handling the paperwork. George whipping on his business card. Oh, man, shout out to George cars. right here. Hey, if you guys wanna order a vet, there's his contact info right there, okay? Or, or not order okay. a vet, because we have a list. If they want to buy one that's in stock, just go to harborchevrolet.com. Okay, okay. Easy. Hey, literally. When you find the one you want, uh, can I speak to George Lopez? There you go. Oh. There you go, John. <laughs> Hallelujah. My man. Sexy though, isn't it? So where's the office, back at Division? You're in the office, baby. Hey, yo, guys. Hit him up. <laughs> I want his phones blown the fuck up. All right, let's see. We got top down. Just hold it, hold it, hold it down. Let's see if it does. Maybe we gotta start it first. One, two, and press and hold. Ooh! Let's start up. Oh, let's continue. Hold it. We have to here. hold the button. <laughs> there you go. Sick. Yeah, Work here too? No, I actually just applied. It. Oh, you just apply here? Hey, you want to be on the vlog? What do you, what do you, think, what do you think of the new car for the channel, bro? I love it. It's it's nice. It's really nice. <laughs> I, unexpected, honestly. We're going, we going American muscle this time. Hey, his, lies lit up. his eyes lit up. Hey, hey, like, hey, oh, hey, hey. You better get that 300 kit. 300? Yeah, go 300. Okay, we're going wide body. Yes. What, what about the uh, what about the Pandem kit? That's nice, too. It's different. That's <laughs> nice. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Hit me in the comments. Let me know what I should do. Hey, thank you, man. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. All right, George. All right, man. Thank you, bro. What, what did you apply to do or what? Uh, salesman. I actually okay, okay. Work at there you go. Get I'm that actually. money. Okay. We're here. We're all the same. Ooh, she's so sexy. Oh, my goodness. Oh, hey, you're looking good in this thing. <laughs> I 
Let's go, baby! Ooh, ooh. How's it feeling? It feels good. <laughs> Super awesome. It's like smooth. There's so much leg room. I can like literally recline in this thing. Like in none of, none of my other cars you can do this. And with the top down, it's just it's just amazing. <laughs> Alright, now Paradox is in the uh, driver's seat. This cockpit is really nice. We got Michelle over here. Lots of leg room, huh? Yeah. Honey. Oh yeah, there's lots. Yeah. It's nice. So we got 120 miles on the car total. We're breaking it in. Speaking of breaking it in. Got the heaters! So awesome. Hella foggy out here, but we stopped at a gas station somewhere in between LA and Sacramento. And this thing is just driving beautifully. Like, it drives so smooth and I, I just love this thing. I mean, even though it's an automatic, I think it was a good buy because it just feels great. Like, the speed, when you, when you smash on the gas on this thing, <laughs> you saw it. it was like 65 to 120 really quick so that's dope look how good she looks oh all right time to fuel up the uh the gas economy on this thing seems like it's really nice because um in touring mode you're just cruising at like below like 1.5 thousand rpm or something like that and it it feels great uh, it's actually like probably better on gas than all of my JDM cars. <laughs> all right, we got in sport mode and she's hitting the hills. How does the sport mode feel different than touring? It's super tight. Like, she's a hugger. <laughs> she, like, this thing hugs the turns and it, you can feel it gripping. You can feel it like drop down and grip. It's like a spider. Ooh, yeah. can't wait to try track mode. Huh? It's track mode. Uh, track mode is what you put on when you go like racing, racing. And we made it back with no issues, just a couple dead bugs, 400 something miles from LA all the way up to Auburn without any rock chips. Spectacular. You can't ask for any more than that. Yo, guys, <laughs> I've never had like a car that had really good interior before. Check this out. Like, I just have to gush over this interior one more time because it just looks so good. And it's got, you know, little, little Corvette emblems and stuff like that. And I, I love this setup. It's very like driver focused. So you feel like you're driving like a fighter jet. You know what I mean? It's just so cool because all your control panels are right there. Oh, so nice. I promise you, I'm going to keep this clean. Okay. No eating in here. <laughs> all right. Oh, and this up front. Team Corvette, baby. Okay, okay. I got all kinds of parts coming for this thing. So we're gonna make it look even better. And of course, we're gonna wrap it at some point, but not too soon. I think we're gonna enjoy this uh, nice crystal looking white color for now. Dang. <laughs> I love this thing. This thing just looks so exotic. I can't, I can't even believe this is real right now. I still feel like I'm driving a rental car because it just doesn't feel real that this is our car. So, <laughs> dude, this is so awesome. Let me know what you guys think about the 2022 Corvette Spider. Uh, can, do you call it a Spider or a convertible? I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about this car for the channel. It's definitely our fastest car right now. And I just can't wait to put all kinds of mods on this thing. I'm looking at the Pandem kit. I'm looking at the Street Hunter kit. I'm looking at the uh all the rocket bunny accessories that you can get for it 
I really like like that big kind of like straight wing in the back. So I might get one of those. Um, definitely, we're gonna do some side splitters and front splitters and all that stuff. And we're gonna lower this wheel gap. Look at that. Three fingers, unacceptable, unacceptable. <laughs> All right, guys, let me know what you guys think. Until next time, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching the channel. I'll catch you guys later.